Hi, Tigers. Uh, Carson and I are here today to read together for the read aloud for today for Osuna. Yep. And uh, we chose a book that we can actually read together. It's yeah. called You Read to, to Me, me I'll, I'll Read, read to, to You. It's by Marianne Hoberman and it's illustrated by Michael, Michael Emberley. Emberley. You read to me, I'll read to you. So Carson's going to be reading the warmer colors and I'm going to be reading the cooler colors. And here is the introduction. 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 Here's, Here's a, a book, book with, with something, something new. new. You read to me, I'll read to you. We'll read each page, page to, to one, one another. another. You'll read one side. I'll read the other. But, but who will read? Now, now guess this riddle. When, when the, the words, words are in the middle, middle the answer's easy. easy. Plain as pie. We'll read together, you, you and, and I. I. The first one's called The Great Big Cat. Or Cat. just The Big Cat. Oh my, I spy a great big cat. A great big cat? I don't like that. Run, mice, run. Stay, cat, stay. Oh, oh good, the, the mice, mice have, have got, got away. Now, pussy cat, that isn't nice. You shouldn't scare the little mice. You know you want them for your food, but eating mice is really rude. It's not a proper thing to do. Why, what if someone gobbled you? Think how sad your friends would feel if you were eaten for a meal. We'll give you cream, your very own, if you will leave the mice alone. And when you're done and full and fat, we'll find a book about a cat. A cat like you with fluffy fur who laps up cream and loves to purr. And lives inside a little house and never, ever dines on a mouse. We'll you both will read, read the book, book to you. you. The, the mice, mice can sit and listen too. The next one's called I Hate My Hat. I hate my hat. Actually, except, I, I like my hat. And we both like our hats. <laughs> yeah, except for, like, I, I mean, it just goes with the story. Yeah. Of, so. I, I hate, hate my, my hat. hat. I hate my hat. I think it's nice. I hate my hat. You said that twice. I hate my hat. Now that's a third. I hate my hat. I hate that word. You hate that word? What word is that? The word you just said. You mean my hat? No, not your hat. Your hat looks great. I like your hat. It's hate I hate. But not my hat. You don't hate that? Of course I don't. I like your hat. You like my hat? I said I do. I think your hat looks good on you. You like my hat? I like it fine. I like your hat. Do you like mine? Why, yes, I do. It suits your head. Now let's do something else instead. Something else we both would like. Let's wear our hats and ride a bike. That sounds good. We'll take a snack. What, what should, should we do when we get back? Something, something that, that we, we like, like to do. do. You, you read, read to me, me, I'll read to you. you. <laughs> I'm not taking off my hat. I know. You're not taking off your hat. <laughs> the next one's called, well, actually, we're skipping a few in between because otherwise it would be a really long read yeah. loud. This one's called The, the dime. dime. I found a dime. You found a dime? I'm finding money all the time. Where do you find it? Here and there, along the street and everywhere. I lost a dime. You lost a dime? I'm losing money all the time. I wonder if you found my dime. I found my dime at dinner time. I lost my dime at 5 o'clock when I was walking down the block. If what I found belongs to you... There's just one dime instead of two. Shall we divide the dime into two? A nickel each? It's up to you. Or shall we buy one thing to share? That would be fun. That would be fair. We could buy a storybook. We'll hold it so we both can look. We can hold it so we both can see. I'll, I'll read, read to you. You read, read to me. me. I think I'll keep it on. It's a little pig and a, pig and a cat, I think. Is that a cat? Looks like a cat. Or a bunny. Yeah, maybe. Maybe it's a bunny. Who knows? The next one we chose is called The Telephone. Ding-a-ling! Ding-a-ling! The, the telephone, telephone begins, begins to ring. ring. Hello? Hello! 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 It's me. I know, it's me. I know. 
Are you in bed? Not yet, are you? I'm almost there. I'm almost too. I'm in pajamas. I'm not yet. I took a bath. My hair's still wet. Did you do the spelling list? I did, did you? There's one I missed. I missed too. I had to look. Have you read the chapter book? I just started chapter three. I have two, so read with me. Read together, not alone, while we're on the telephone? It won't take long to get it done. I'll get my book. It sounds like fun. Back and forth until we're through. You read to me, I'll read to you. So that that person right there is the one that just got out of the shower, and then that's the one in the pajamas that uh got two that missed two on the spelling test. <laughs> We like this one. It's called The Bear. The Bear. <laughs> My little brother saw a bear. He saw a bear? Saw it where? He said he saw it in his bed. That's where it was, my brother said. Your brother saw a bear in bed. In his own bed? That's what he said. I bet it gave him quite a fright. I asked if it could spend the night. Uh, spend the night right in his bed? The bear asked that? That's what he said. So what did your brother say? He told the bear that it could stay, that it could stay a night or more if it would promise not to snore. Your little brother sounds quite ba brave to tell a brother how to behave. No, to tell, tell a bear, bear how, how to, to behave. behave. He said he fed it from a cup. Sometimes he likes to make things up. Mm, he, ma he made it up about the bear? Perhaps he did, but... I don't care. It's still a story that is fun. Then let's make up another one. We'll, we'll write, write it down, down and, and when, when we're through, through, you'll read to me, I'll, I'll read to you. The next one we chose because we know somebody with a birthday today. today. And it starts, it's called New Friends, and it starts with my birthday's here. And so we want to give a shout out to Michaela and anybody else who's having a birthday that we're missing while we're not at school. And in the story, it actually says, I'm turning six, but Michaela's turning nine today. So we're well, going to try to remember to change it I to mean, nine. We don't really know, but that's like our best guess. No, I, th I, I think we. I checked. She's oh. nine. <laughs> well, new friends. friends. My birthday's here. And mine is too. How old are you? How old are you? I asked you first. You've got to say. All right, I'm nine. I'm nine today. Why, I am too. We're just the same. We both are nine. What, well, what's your name? Well, what is yours? You've got to tell. I asked you first. It's Annabelle. What? Now, what is yours? Why don't you guess? You've got to tell. All right, it's Jess. Where do you live? I live quite near. Where do you live? A block from here. It's funny that we've never met. I've walked right by your house, I bet. I bet I've walked right by yours, too. And yet, we never met. Uh, and yet, we never even knew. Well, let's be friends. I'd like that fine. Now you're my friend. And you are mine. Do you know how to read? Do you? I asked you first. I can. Me too. Well, well if, if we, we both, both can read, let's you, do. You read to me, I'll, I'll read to you. Here's the end. I wish it wasn't the end. I wish yeah. we could see you all the time. Yeah. I want to say hi to my class, Room 102 kids. Kingston's class. All the fifth graders. Actually, all the tigers. We're happy to see all of you. Yep. The, the end. end. We're, we're at, at the end. The very end. The, the, the very, 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 very end. end. No more words. Or pictures look. No more stories. In this book. But, but there, there are other books, books to read. Hundreds. Thousands. All, all we need. Any time, in any weather, we can sit right down together. In the shade. Or in the sun. Choose a book. That that looks like fun. One that's old. Or one that's new. Make believe. Or really true. I'll read one line. I'll read two. You, you read, read to me. me. I'll read to you.
Happy reading, tigers. It's the yep. end. Yeah, it, it's it's a it's a fun book for two people. You, you can't really... I mean, you can read it by yourself. It's just not as fun. So, and... So we hope you have somebody to read with. Yep. We'll talk to you soon. Bye, tigers.